Hey guys, welcome back to Yes or No Item Reviews. My name is Omar. In this video, we're going to unbox, set up, and review the Utex 8-in-1 Pop-Up Children Play Tent. And we're going to unbox that right now. Whoa, Braxton! Daddy's unboxing Braxton's new toy! Wow! It's a paper! So that's it? Wow! Go closer, Daddy! What is it? That's it. It's Whoa! So pretty much, guys, it's like this. It's just like a camping bag. And so this is the front. This is the back. And it has a handle. So now let's open it. So it's basically like that inside. Whoa, it's very colorful. And it comes with one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven and eight. Okay guys, so we were gonna start in this two basic house right here. Be cautious, cautious. Cautious. cautious when you open it because it will just gonna pop for like this. You ready? Wow! Oh, so there's like two in that! Abracadabra! Oh, so there's four! Wow! Okay, so all you need to do is just pretty much open it. It's like that. And kind of like assist here in the bottom. And boom! Wow! Hey guys, quick question. Is this video helping you? If so, do yourself a favor by clicking the like button, subscribe button, and the bell so that you'll be the first to get notified to all the latest videos. Let's get back to the review. And this one right here, guys, is you will just gonna tie this if you are using it outside. Like let's say you will gonna go in your backyard or your front yard or in the park, or you're gonna bring it in camping, you just put it there, and then... Whoosh, how do you call the English? The whoosh. Yeah, that's right, English. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. You will push, so it will stay there when the wind will blow it. So this is the purpose for this. So don't lose this, guys. So probably right now, I know what's in your mind. How long they are, what's the length, and what's the width, and what's their size. That's why I have this with me. So I'm just gonna measure one of them. Bottom and here, 39 inches. The thickness where your kids will be in, 19 inches. And let's get one of the house. So from the bottom all the way to the top, it is 35 inches. The wideness is 31 inches. And as you can see, there's hole here, 17 inches. 
and the same. It is 17 by 17 wow. inches, the hole where your kids are. So next is this square, almost 28 inches. How tall it is? 28 and a half inches. So right now, guys, we will gonna try to assemble them, okay? First, let's get this. You need to look for this hole right here. And all you have to do is just grab this channel. And each channel has this black plastic. Both sides, all you're gonna do is just put it in. Insert, like that. And as you can see, there's kind of like black, this one. Black, um, like a tie. And all you have to do is just shoot this yellow here. And then that's it. But to make it sure so they're well connected, I'll do it twice for safety purposes. And then you're gonna do exactly the same on the other side. All you have to do is get this plastic and then pair it to this uh, ribbon right here, like that. But I wanna make it double to make sure, or triple. It's up to you guys. So it's not, you know, it's really locked. There you go. And then, there you go. Okay, next, so we're gonna grab the cube. It's up to you guys, you can put, you know, cube here, or you can put this one right here. So it's up to you, so I'll put this cube for a change. Insert this, and do exactly what you did on the first tent. And now, it will look like this. Oh, I'm so fat. Oh my God, I'm ruining it. I can't fit guys, I'm so fat. Okay, so we'll set aside this for now. And then guys, you will just gonna copy what you did on the first time. Rah! I need to get you out, baby. Go. All right, guys. Yes! Yes! We're done! Yay! Oh, no. Oops. Oh, this is wrong. <laughs> it's upside down, so... So, guys, make sure that Oh, there you go. So as you can see, this is more, you know, tinier here. Then this is more kind of like wider. So bottom line, the smallest part will be on the bottom ground and the taller will be on the top. So it will be on the ground like that. There you go. Get my baby, which is the owner of this latent baby Braxton. But hmm, we lock something. Oh, we need to put something so it's more interesting. And unbox it. Now! Whoa! Yeah! I'm very OC about germs, so we're going to clean this right now. Here are some good things about the Utex 8-in-1 play tent house. There are a lot of ventilations in these tents and tunnels. Therefore, there are a lot of air circulations, which is great. Also, in almost every angle, you can see your baby playing inside the play tent without worrying if he is stuck inside or not. 
Even if he is stuck somewhere in the tents or tunnels for any reason, it's very easy to disassemble to get your kid out. Not only is it easy to disassemble, it's easy to assemble because you don't need any extra tools to set this whole play tent up. Here are some negative things about the Utex. Because the Utex tent is so light in weight, the structure is easy to be pushed around and therefore disorganized when played around with. When playing outside, you have to use the pegs if you want the tent to be sturdy and stay in place. Also, some people might say that this tent house could take up a lot of space. Depending on your situation, rewind the video to the measurements to see if this size of the tent is right for you. Finally, it doesn't come with the mini play balls. You have to purchase them separately. Honestly though, this is still a great purchase. Even if this play tent house is large, you don't have to use every part of it. You don't even have to make this into a square. Your tent could be a long straight line if you want it to be. It's pretty flexible and gives you room to experiment. If you decide to use this indoors, you don't even have to use the pegs. Finally, even if the mini play balls are not included, it's still going to be a fun experience for whoever can fit through the tunnels. If you want to learn more about the Utex 8-in-1 Play Tent House, or if you want to purchase one for yourself, I'll leave links in the description section below. And please let us know your opinion on this item in the comment section because we would love to hear what you think about it. Also, check out these other clips that are similar and related to this video to the right of your screen. Until then, I will see you at the next item.